Hello again, and welcome to Fishing Diary number 5. Uh, Thursday the 10th of March, taking a day off work, really. Just try and get down to the lake to drive down, but the weather's not the best, it's very windy, as uh, you can see I'm sheltered up, which is it's quite nice, a bit of cushy. And uh, just had the first fish, which is a snotty bream, so saved uh, saved me from a blank session, so I'm grateful for that. Um, just three on this lake, me, my dad, my next swim, and a friend of mine on the other side of the lake, he's just lost two fish. So a bit of a shame for him, but um, I'm happy I had a brain to be honest. And uh, I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later, just a bit of an entry here, you know. About midday now, so a few hours fishing done, just the one bream, missed one run, but see how it goes. This is a, a benefit of being down at Viaduct as well during the week and on Saturdays. There is a, a chip shop very near. So, the father has kindly got me some nice hot chips. And I got some chicken nuggets in the bag as well. So, just a, a minute drive up the road, really. Tony's, uh, Tony's fish, shop, fish and chip shop. I'll put the number across the screen when I edit the video so hopefully if anyone comes down you can uh, give them a call and pick up some fish and chips Cheers! Hello again and just had the, the first carp of the session just of a uh, £14 ounce over so £14 one ounce uh, a stunning linear I have to say very nice fish it was quite quite plump had a bit of a being up mouth which is a shame but uh, yeah happy with that so we had two bring two snotties and a, and a nice linear £14, so top bombing. Hopefully I'll get it, well I will get another one, I hope anyway. Cheers guys. Hello again and it's now 5 o'clock and I had another car about two hours ago I think it was. Little five pound ish mirror but lovely lovely fully scaled pretty much I'll show you a picture of that one next but it's just when it grows bigger it'll be a very nice car I know there's quite a few heavily scaled mirrors in here but I think that's probably one of the best I've seen so check the rods out again I'm just getting an occasional knock but it could be wind uh, hopefully I can get another one before the end of the session so so far it's two cart and uh, two bream, so not too bad for the weather conditions, I think. Alright, hello once again, and another update 14 pound 3 ounce. Bam, that's all I can say already. Uh, mental stuff, it had been out for about two minutes, the bait had. Shot off, I had a uh, Kept the rod all tight, it had no bait running around, quite a stiff clutch because it was near a snag, so the rod took curved around, just whacked into it, and pulled them out of the snag, luckily. So, uh, yeah, three carp, two bream. Uh, it's starting to get a bit dusk now, but the sun's coming out, the wind's dropping down, so hopefully, hopefully, I'll find another two, one, two carp maybe. So, uh, I'll report back on you guys in a little bit. Toodles. Righty ho, so uh, coming up to session end now. Probably got about another 10 minutes fishing left. Just got the one rod out. Um, final scores, I had four cup, two 14s, one 10, one, I think it's about five pounds, and two bream. So, for the weather conditions it was today, 
which is windy, quite a lot of a uh, bit of showers, bit of sun, bit of mixed really. Well, all right, mixed. No, I think it's pretty good. Dad had two bream. The guy on the opposite side of the lake, my friend, I think he said he had three carp in the end and kept them getting snapped up and snagged. So uh, another end to another fishing session. Pretty good. Um, hope you've enjoyed. Comment, rate, subscribe, and the usual stuff. And uh, I'll see you soon, guys. Peace out.